Welcome to Betting the Breeders' Cup presented by FanDuel TV. We kick it all off on Future Stars Friday with the Juvenile Turf Sprint. Here are the morning line odds presented by FanDuel. And we must start with Big Evs. 3-1 to one on the morning line coming in from England. And man, is this horse fast. Britt Ayrton alongside Nick Luck. And we start there. Mick Appleby, the trainer, first starter in North America. What do we need to know about this runner? Well, we need to know that the trainer is very capable. And he's proven this year that he can do it with two-year-olds as well. We also know that this horse is unusually fast out of the gates for a European two-year-old. Now, the form as it stands, you could pick holes in. What you can't pick holes in is his performances on the clock, particularly this win at Royal Ascot, which I still believe is his best success. The question for me today is the extent to which he will be accompanied on the lead by some very fast horses and the extent to which that might compromise him. Five furlongs over the turf course. Fast and furious speed is the name of the game for these young horses. As we bring in our handicappers to get their insight, Eddie Olchek, Matt Bernier, this race is a doozy and it kicks us off on Breeders' Cup Friday. Yeah, Britt, Nick brought up the pace scenario. Let's start with Big Evs because there's a ton of gas to the inside in here. Is he going to get run off his feet? The one, the three, the four, the five, the eight. Uh, European I mean, look, speed's look, not the same as American speed. Fair. Uh, this is your strength. Uh, this is my weakness. I mean, I'm glad Nick is still uh, on call here <laughs> because I, I, I've never really been able to really handicap when these Euros come to North America, Maddie, and just try to figure that out and gauge. If there was one horse here that I would look at, it would be no name Mets because I feel that possibly to be able to sit in behind the speakers. I think they're going to go awfully quick early. I also think of the horses drawn to the inside, I think No Name Mets is the best. Now, maybe I'm a little bit biased here with, you know, the American runner, but sure. I think the talent is abundant with that runner. What about the nine? Well, look, if this thing melts down, a horse like Amidst Waves can certainly come and pick up some pieces. Shards can do the same thing. I want a horse that's going to be close, but not on the lead. And if you can go back and watch the replay from Slider's Speakeasy here at Santa Anita, he blows the turn. He kind of loses his mind, looks around for a little bit, and then still is able to come back and get the job done. I like the fact that he can sit and still be effective. And he's going to probably be, be every bit of that 8-1. to one. I, I would like to ask Nick. Nick, do you believe that... Uh your speed, so to speak, European speed is not like U.S. speed on the grass? And not Nick's speed. <laughs> <laughs> I have no speed. Anyone, anyone can outrun me. You know that. What I think here, and listening to you talking about the type of horse you want, makes me half interested in number five here, Give Me the Beat Boys, who has got some pace, so can lie handy enough, but should sit just in behind, has class and can stay a bit further. So if it does melt down... Matt and Edzo, give me the beat, boys. I think just sneaks into your calculations. Uh, you know what? I'm hitting the all button because <laughs> I have no clue. <laughs> five eighths, that's also a key. This race last year at Keeneland, five and a half furlongs. Here on Friday afternoon, five furlongs. Big difference. <laughs> Got to have deep pockets at the all button and that type of res. All right, well, you can make some money on that one with the prices because it could go any which direction. And why don't you do so with the FanDuel Sportsbook app, the only place where you can bet the Breeders' Cup. And right now, new customers can get a no-sweat win bet up to $200. That means you'll get up to $200 back if the horse you pick to win doesn't win. So download the FanDuel app and bet the Breeders' Cup today.